up, foodies? Or should I say drinkies? Well, maybe drinkers. Anyway, I'm in the San Marco neighborhood at Town Hall, and we're going to get into some of their craft cocktails. So let me introduce you to the bar manager. This is Robert. Thanks for having me. Of course, of course. It's great to have you in. Okay, so let's give everyone, before I try some of these delicious beverages, an idea of your cocktail menu. Yeah, so we do seasonally rotating cocktail menus. We normally have one for spring and summer, and then another one in fall, winter. Oh, fun. Yeah. Okay, and then you also have specials like a, a wine special throughout? Yeah, so we actually do um, different themed wine tastings every single week. Oh, so they'll cool. either be varietally themed or region or just something interesting that we're thinking of doing that week. Oh, that's so neat. All right, so you made some really beautiful cocktails here. So talk us through um, maybe this one first. Yeah, so this is our Violet Monarch. This is going to be made with plush plum vodka, actually local to Jacksonville, a little velvet falernum and some lemon juice. And then we're doing a butterfly pea flower simple that actually makes it change colors. Oh. We're pouring that at table side. It's so beautiful. And then what is this garnish? That's so pretty. Yeah, so this is actually a freeze dried plum. Oh, interesting. Okay, I'm gonna take a sip of this one. And it looks like a sugar rim here. Yes, ma'am. Mm. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's delicious. Oh, I love that. And but this is gonna be not on the menu forever, right? Nope, so we will probably oh. be swapping this up once spring comes around. All right, so you guys better come and get this. All right, let me more sit. <laughs> mm. That's delicious. Okay, what do we have here? This is beautiful. This definitely looks seasonal. Yeah, so this is our prettiest in the patch. This is gonna be more of like a pumpkin spice themed cocktail. And so I we're, love that. Yeah, so we're making this with house infused rum that we're infusing down with cinnamon sticks and cloves. Really? Yeah, add in a little bit of lemon juice, um, a pumpkin syrup, and then that foam on top is actually gonna come from an egg white. Okay, let's 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 do the drum roll here. Okay, I'm excited. It's really beautiful. Oh my gosh! Wow! And it's not like because when you said rum, I was like, oh, that's interesting. I've never had a rum drink with pumpkin. That is a wonderful combination. I'm really impressed with both of these drinks. I absolutely love it. One more sip. <laughs> mm. And I noticed too, when you were making these cocktails, you have a lot of, looks like, homemade or handmade uh, syrups and, and juices and that kind of thing? Yep, yep, so we use all house uh, made syrups. So those are gonna be a lot of different versions of simple syrups, all fresh squeezed citrus, and then we try and use as much local product as possible. Okay, well tell everyone when uh, they can come and hang out with you at the bar. Yeah, so we're, hours are from 4.30 to nine on weeknights, and then Friday, Saturday, we close down at 10, and then we run brunch on Sundays. Oh, Sunday brunch, you know I love that too. All right, well Robert, uh, you've outdone yourself here and this is just a small sampling of what they have to offer and again these won't last forever because they change their menu seasonally so you got to come check it out oh I don't know which one to end on I think I'm just gonna drink them both <laughs> thanks again Robert absolutely mm. delicious